Iman Gadzi's channel is one of the fastest growing financial channels. He provides valuable content, but what's also interesting is his editing style. In this video, I will show you some of the commonly used effects by Iman that you can also achieve in Premiere Pro. He frequently uses this grid background in his videos and it's extremely easy to create. Once you have created it, you can change its colors and use it multiple times. First, navigate to your project panel and click on new item to create a color mat. Choose a dark gray color, then drag the color mat into the timeline. Next, go to the effects panel and search for grid. Apply the grid effect to the color mat. Then, go to Effects Controls and change the size from the corner point to the width slider. Increase the width to around 250 or any other value you prefer. Change the blend mode to overlay and decrease the opacity to your liking. Now, search for ramp in the effects and apply the effect to your color mat. Ensure that the ramp shape is set to linear ramp and then increase the blend with the original to 100 or 90 depending on your preference. If you wish to change the white color to another color, you can do so. Let's change it to red. Moreover, you can move the ramp by changing the position values to give it a different look. You might want to play with the blend with original value to achieve better results. Once you finish that, go to the Effects tab and search for Noise. Apply the Noise effect to the color mat. In the Effects Control panel, increase the Noise amount to around 4 or 5. You can disable the Noise type if you prefer. This is what your background will look like now. He is using multiple animations in his videos, and creating each animation would take a hell of a time. That's when Envato came in, which provides an amazing collection of video templates and a vast library of video assets for all types of software. With just a single subscription, you can download an unlimited number of video templates, including transitions, openers, promos, titles, and much more. Envato Elements also provides a wide range of software for selecting templates. Additionally, you can also download stock videos, music, sound effects, graphics, and other valuable assets. Download the templates you need and use them easily by dragging and dropping. Check out the Envato Elements link in the description below for a 7-day free trial. The next effect he mostly uses for his animations is the wave effect. To create this effect, create a new adjustment layer and drag it onto your timeline. Then, go to Effects and search for Turbulent Displace. Apply it onto your adjustment layer. In the Effects Control Panel, change the amount to 10 and the size to 50 or 40, depending on your preference. Now, create an evolution keyframe where the animation starts, and another one at the end where you want to end the animation. Increase the evolution until you are satisfied with the intensity. That's it. The effect is now ready to use. With the wave effect, he also slowed down his animation's frames to make it more cinematic. To achieve a low frame rate, go to the effects search for posterize time, and then apply it on the same adjustment layer. After applying the effect, go to the effects control and change the frame rate to around 10 or 15, depending on how choppy or smooth you want the animation to be. This will help you achieve the same style as Iman Gatsi's animation. That's all about this tutorial. If you need a more depth tutorial on how to animate a character like Iman Gadzi, please let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.